There's no white on the landscape, a rarity for Oregon's national forests in winter. But that means travelers are having to find other ways to spend their time. If you're not much into skiing or snowshoeing, this is a great opportunity to get out and hike or bike. A lot of our trails are open. The Mackenzie River Trail is a popular spot for hikers. And even with no snow on the ground, the Terwilliger Hot Springs still draw a crowd. So people, you know, like that are driving over to Sisters or, or just on a road trip have been stopping in to, to see the falls, which during this time of year is normally not accessible. But that's certainly not the only hot spot on the Mackenzie. Yeah, it's about 210 degrees. Beltnap Lodge in Hot Springs sits off Highway 126, and the staff admit the not quite hidden gem on the river can be easy to miss. Because of the uh, scenic byway and stuff, can't put up too much signage out there, so it is, it's, it's tucked away. and. Little known sometimes to some folks that just travel by. The water for the pool is piped in from the source across the bridge. The staff here keep the pool at a steamy 104 degrees. But you'll find more than 20 minerals in the spring water. And people who come here to take a soak swear by the pool's rejuvenating power. Good for what ails you during the winter time, that's for sure. It's like your cares wash away and you just kind of melt and and it's just like you don't want to leave. And with a garden, two heated pools, along with rooms with a view, large cabins and campsites for rent, you certainly don't have to leave in a hurry. Just a few ways you can soak up some warmth on a chilly day. Near Blue River, I'm Joel Porter for News Source 16.